啦啦。Hello, peeps, and welcome back to Mitten University. Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. I didn't do any training between episodes <laughs> because we've got a ghost, and I don't actually have anybody that can deal with ghosts. I want to try and get the No Deaths Award, but this doctor is constantly killing patients in this cure clinic.、Um, so we've got stuff going on, right? And、uh, I am.、Um, what I decided was that. Um, we're handling on the GP side of things. We are handling things okay, right? The the cues aren't that bad at all,、um, not at all.、Um, and I really want to be able to do this challenge. So we are going to build a second training room,、um, which will eat into level eight. But you know what? I think that's. What I would like to do, so that's what we're going to do.、Uh, indeed, let's do this, and we're going to try and copy this room a little、uh, to a certain extent.、Um, hang on a minute. We could put these training rooms together if we do this right. <laughs> if we do this right, everybody, we can put these training rooms together.、Um, excellent. And、um, actually, I've instantly done it wrong. Can you see? Can you do you see?、Uh, let's pop that there. We'll get a window in here. A window in here. And boom. Get a couple of、uh, training desks down. Excellent. Brilliant.、Um, and then we could do with a radiator. Will They will. So it sounds like we need another janitor. That's worth bearing in mind.、Um, oh, we decided as well, didn't we? That they probably like to have a radiator、uh, nearby. So there we are. It's going to make this side of the room very hot, isn't it? Very hot, because both those radiators are on the same side.、Uh, <laughs> there we are. It's happened.、Um, uh, so the skeleton for our training boost. There it is. Excellent. And、uh, this as well has a training boost. Pop that there.、Um, Just because I like it,、uh, we probably should have a clock、um, for everybody. Otherwise, it's not—it's not so bad. Two point radio. Not so bad. This is two point radio, what's, and what's it like? I am Nigel Bickleworth at yeah, your、right. service. It's、and、all right. It's all right. Begin another of our shows. Let's edit this. A little something I like to call music. And add it over here. There we go. That's all right, isn't it? And then, what's it like for heating in this building over here? It's not—it's not too bad actually. So let's pop that there,、um, and we could probably put in a bit of extra entertainment、uh, for this area.、Uh, to be honest, that wouldn't be too bad. We can move this over as well. That seems—that seems pretty good. So we can now train. Uh, two lots of staff at once. I always like to try and get to. Oh dear.、Uh, I always like to try and get to、uh, four training rooms where I can.、Um, that tends to to be the aim for me、um, initially. But you don't want to build them too fast because of the old level. I think that's helped a little bit. Looks like we're starting to need to expand psychiatry. Now, look how many we have coming into psychiatry. It's quite a lot. It is quite a lot.、Um, so that is probably going to have to happen in level eight. The expansion, promote three staff.、Uh, yeah, 
I'd love to. So we could really do with getting one of our janitors here into uh, Ghost Catcher. Let's get Peter Geist in to train that. I think really we would also benefit from employing um, another janitor. Um, uh, yeah. Littera. Sort of seems a bit antiproductive, doesn't it, really? Um, but I think that's what we're going to do. Ties easily. No, actually. Actually, no. Um, morally ambiguous. 29. Peggy. Yeah, okay. I'm going to have to wait. I want better. Better. I want better. Let's uh, get another a bit of staff training going. So... Yeah, you are killing too many people. It's time to get you in for a bit of treatment training with Meredith Beard. Off you go. Um, that would be great. Stop your dancing. <laughs> Stop your dancing and get on with it. We're missing a doctor. White coat, average height, oh. answers to doctor. Oh, really? <laughs> Stella. We're doing we're doing all right on the GPs still. We are doing all right. We're pushing that reputation up as well. Reducing those prices will help. Um, Is there any more hideous space in all this county than the meltdown? Oh. Nothing but a toxic wasteland. Oh. Why, when I was a lad, it was merely a wasteland. Hold in. Oh, that's progress for you. There we go. Send you for treatment. Can send you for treatment. There we go. Can you see that? I mean, the GPs, they're doing fine. Don't need to worry about the GPs uh, for expansion. What I would say, though, is that we do need to see about uh, expanding this next before we take on a new illness. We need to get better at the illnesses that we're doing before we take on more. Um, so that's a thing. <laughs> that is absolutely a thing. Um, so it'll probably be that we move psychiatry out of here um, and we do have two uh, psychiatrists but if we're going to build a second psychiatry room we would need to employ a third psychiatrist um, that would definitely need to happen as well um, what is this clown clinic yeah go home uh, okay all right everybody it's all right so let's should we do that should we do this um first of all should we find oh 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 i like you a lot actually you're in i like you a lot um yeah i do <laughs> yeah i do excellent There we go. Excellent. So we'll keep listening to the uh, the tannoy, the receptionist, and uh, see if we get any more. Oh, brilliant. There we go. So we can, um, I think now, see about hiring a new psychiatrist. Positive and inspiring. That sounds amazing. Hang on. Boris here. No. Donald. Doggle. Donald Hogwash. Wow, he's our new psychiatrist. He's amazing. Oh, I love him. So let's get Froud back in. Um, now, let's build uh, an office. Let's build another psychiatry office. So I think I was going Have a snack. something like we'll this. Right uh, something like this. Something like this. I think it was. But if we do it the other way, we can put them together. We can put them together and it'll be glorious um so let's get that in um let's get uh, a window in there okay let's uh get our carpet in lovely gorgeous looks very plush i like it let's uh, get the uh chair in Okay. Excellent. 
Maybe we can get his uh, his lamp as well. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, I feel that we should probably. Well, that will work. So let's. Oh, what is this? Four patients for the ward. Four patients for the ward. It's good. Right, he looks like he could do with going on a break. She's okay, though. Do you know what we might do? How many... We've only got two for the ward, don't we? And I think, again, we could probably employ another nurse... for the ward that would be good there we go we've almost run out of level eight now it just gets worse and worse isn't it? i don't i don't want to go up another level we shall discuss the another level um particularly ones made to radio stations first should we see not shout speak in a calm clear voice we could do it a voice you deem too posh for everyday conversation State Jackie, are you? Be polite at all times. No, Jackie's our also, diagnosis names, nurse. Okay, let's get her weakness. in for diagnosis training. Make that process even more efficient, given that we keep going up levels. Um, okay, I don't think it's going to go very well, but we'll do it, because we could do with uh, some more war training, uh, to be honest. By the looks of things. Right. We were decorating this room. Um, let's see here. Um, so we would like one of these. We would like these to be working for us. Because they help the boost all kinds. Um, do you know what that means, actually? Look at this. So this, this trophy case adds prestige, yes. But we could do... Look. Look at this. We could pull this out. Does it... Oh, hang on a minute. Does it let us? Can we not... Actually, I don't know if we can put it in. We can't put it in. Ooh. Can't put it in there. Okay, fine. Fine. Um, so. Ooh, let's get Benny down. They've already started to pile up out here. So let's get the Benny down. Um, and what's the temperature like? It's, it's, a bit, it's a bit chilly, isn't it? Should we put um, a radiator there? Um, excellent. We actually like we do some more bennies here. <laughs> um, so let's do that. Let's uh, pop a couple of bennies here. There we go. A couple of bennies, and uh, we might actually move this binny here and get one of these. What are these called? Leafless stands. Okay, excellent. Right, back to this. What? No. The send them home <laughs> we'll get there in a minute right so some more diagnosis and treatment boosts for the psychiatrist excellent let's get him a coffee maker uh, with his filing cabinet excellent his certificate to say that he has definitely watched ER not that there was a lot of psychiatry in there, I suppose. Um, Hannibal, maybe? <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's see. So I like the idea. They're always watching the clock, aren't they? <laughs> Should we do... <laughs> yeah, look, we've done him as well. Uh, they like to watch the clock. Um, pop that down. Excellent. Ooh! It's just a decorative item. But I kind of like it, and it's only cheap. Look. Can give him, like, it's more of a... Gives him more privacy. Look. His office space back there. Look at that. Can he actually still walk around that bit? I don't know. I don't know. See, we'll see how that fares. I could be causing too many obstacles for them making it too difficult for them to use all their all their gubbins uh we'll see so a sweet machine this is Nigel definitely um but yeah i'm thinking we might need to just 
reduce sure it a bit. Something that like that. Extraordinary piece of music. A wonderful <laughs> example of non-diatonic counterpoint. Stay tuned for more groundbreaking compositions. <laughs> okay. I love the radio. I love the radio in this game, everyone. My dear. Pop that there. There we go. Now it's a bit more open, isn't it? For them to move around just 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 a little bit more freely, I think. It's it's probably for the best. Um let's get a hand sanitizer in. Uh we will pop that there. Um otherwise though, I think is that everything? I think so. What we'll do now, I know you're about to see somebody, but we are actually going to edit this room and pull it over here. We're going to keep psychiatry together. Uh, so that'll be good. Um, we'll leave that there because another room will probably take its place. Um, let's see about the heating situation. That's not going to go. Okay, should we put radiator here it makes it a bit warm there doesn't it? it does make it a little bit toasty um we could probably now do with a toilet over here which will pop us over into level nine but you know i think we can do it i think we can do level nine famous last words everybody there it is level nine. Oh, you have you got a bit there we go We'll get her sorted. We'll get her sorted. Let's see her in, everybody. Let's give you a promotion. Uh, would like to try and earn 100,000. We'll go for it. We did four out of four out of the ward challenge. Excellent. Now, what's really lovely is that I know that she's unhappy at the moment because we had a little bit of a sticky moment. But when they're attended to, their needs rise. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> um, and they, they'll they probably attend to her again. And deal with her needs once more. Dorothy, Amethyst. It's my birthstone, an Amethyst. I don't know why I know that. Well, I do know why I know that. My nan told me. <laughs> she was into all of that, my nan. Here we go, and we can see the needs go up further again. Look at that. And by the end, you know, she's like proper chuffed. Proper chuffed. And then she'll be cured. Look at that. The ward is great for that, you know? The ward is great for that. Um, so I think we're getting to a point where we could really do with a toilet over here. Um, oh, what's happened here? Tommy Malarkey, are you... Are you you're having you having a few issues? Should we just There we go. There we go. Excellent. Sorry everyone. <laughs> so I think what we could do here is a toilet. Um because uh, we're getting a bit far away from the other place. Look, and they do need the toilet. Call smell my cash. Smell my cash. Because an eighty percent interest repayment rate is nothing to sniff at. Smell my cash. Smell my cash. The ah. desperate, desperate solution. Excellent. There we go. So let's get a radiator <laughs> here with a personal best clock. Radiator. A rad. Let's get a rad in. Should we start calling them rads, everybody? Um, I don't like calling things what they're actually called. It's boring. There we go. There we go. And uh, we'll pop down one of those. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, let's put a Benny here, uh, uh, actually, with a notice board. Don't know about you, but I'm pretty happy with this. Pretty happy with this. But we have gone up into level nine. Look. <laughs> we have gone up into level nine. So it'll mean that we'll have to start watching this just a little bit closer. Um, our reputation is increasing. Our level's gone up again. We will start to see this go up and up and up. Uh, I'm in, uh, I'm surprised. So you're actually doing rather well. Don't be surprised. Um, okay. 
Don't be surprised. You're in the toilet. Attention. Would all visitors please talk silently? Please talk silently. That sounds quite good to me. Go for cure. Excellent. I'd like you to go uh, for treatment as well. You're just coming out of the bathroom. You can go for treatment. Uh, no, you can go home actually. You can go for treatment. You're all coming out of the bathroom now. You can go for treatment. You can go for treatment. Um, you're just in right now. You can go for treatment. Excellent. What are you on? 78%. It's a little bit low. That one's a little bit low. They're bored, which is interesting. Um, I mean, they've been hanging around, I suppose, this area. Um, so maybe we could do something here. Uh, a bookcase and another leaflet stand. Uh, this is not a leaflet stand. This is a magazine rack. So if we do that with a leaflet stand, maybe. That could be all right, couldn't it? There we go. That's all right. That is all right. We did it. We earned the 100,000. Our reputation is going up quite nicely, um, to be honest. Uh, let's start the training. We've got a little bit lax. So the let's start. We really could do with getting our ward management going, for sure. So let's get Nightingale back for that. Uh, our assistants. So we have a temp assistant here. We could really do with... Ooh. We could really do with Brad Volcano. <laughs> uh, it turns out. So let's get him in. And we will fire you. Um, and we will train you in customer services too. It's not that desperate, but we're going to do it. We could, I suppose, have a second. So that the other assistant isn't just wandering around. But I'm kind of hoping that... I mean, we didn't get level three in, in Hogsport, um, which means we don't have the new stand. <laughs> we don't have the new stand. Um, it's a thing. It's a thing. Um, and the new stand would be kind of nice to have. It would be kind of nice to have. Um, I could go back and get Hogsport to, to three stars and unlock those bits and bobs, but I wouldn't want to do it on camera, I don't think. That's that's the problem with it. But do we want to keep going on without the newsstand? Do you know what I mean? Um, we will be going back to Hogsport once we've been through all the hospitals. Let me know how you feel about it. I, I'd like to just carry on and not go backwards. Um, but I could very quickly. I mean, you know, Hogsport's a nice, quick, easy little level, isn't it? And I'm sure we've all seen it a million times. And I could get the newsstand. Let me know if you'd like to see it services. or if I'm okay to just go and get it <laughs> between episodes. Um, I think that might be nice. Oh no, we killed somebody. We killed somebody. Let's view that right now. And um, open all. Okay, fine. Fine. How are we? Let's get them to the top of the queue. Their happiness is falling. Uh, oh, they can just go straight for treatment or they can go home. Um, cure 10 patients. Sure, I think we could probably do that. That shouldn't be too terrible. So there's four new patients queuing there and one here. So we're starting to perhaps maybe be considering a further diagnosis. Um, GP's office so that they stop coming to here and um, that's something that's on our on on um, our radar something else is on our radar is patient flow at the moment we have a pharmacy here which could go with treatment so we actually have two solid treatments which could be far away say up here we could do with moving general diagnosis into the more where this diagnosis area is and put a GP's office with it so that they don't need to come back here, you know? So that's the sort of things that I'm starting to think about now. Um, it's on my mind. They're, they're the sorts of things I'm thinking, what's the best way to, while I'm managing this, what's the best way to proceed? Because, you know, I mean, we have to carry on 
uh, with all this training um, to make sure that everybody is getting better all of the time. Better and better. Um, you know, it's a thing. Um, so. Excellent. This training course is almost over. Um, I've got a janitor on the go. So they all have their first levels. And it just makes it easier as well to see who's supposed to be working where. So I quite like the idea, I think, of getting this nurse in for her ward training. That might be really nice. Um, our reputation's doing really well. Um, I'm enjoying that. I am enjoying that. There it is. So let's get our nurse in. Aubrey here. I'd like you to do some ward training. Uh, excellent. Excellent. Um, don't like this. Don't like this. Have a snack. We'll be right back. Um, let's go to here. And so now, yeah, I think we are starting to see reviews. a need. This time, looking at the new but in again, to be Tell fair, if need. we continue to train, taking selection of musically inspired pastries, such as this strumming strudel and the cacophonous cake, I awarded four macarons. Ha! Yeah. See, look at that. If we were to train, oh dear, what's going on here? On break. If we were to um, diagnose people more efficiently and better, actually these two GP offices would be okay. So I think we'll concentrate before we consider that third one. I think what we'll do is continue to train these guys so that they are better at diagnosing at that initial stage so that we have less going through for further diagnosis um you know we still need to build on our foundation i don't like this what are you are you okay just been to the toilet ugly environment attractive environment yeah, there is a small patch in the bathroom, isn't there, that doesn't do too well. Into the staff room. It's quite a nice staff room. This is the only staff room as well, isn't it? We're getting to a point, really, where we could consider having a staff room up here as well. That would be a pretty good use of level nine a staff from up here so that the, all this staff don't have to keep moving walking all the way back to there yeah <laughs> thinking as we're doing our training you have to you know think about what's the best way to use this level you know so that the hospital is better moving forwards and i know that it a lot of people are diehards for building more GP offices. It's not the answer. It's not that you. All you'll do is get yourself into trouble. Building more GP offices because you see queues at the GPs will only make it worse. You'll just need to keep building GP offices because nobody, no, none of your GPs will be any good at what they're doing. You'll be putting up the hospital level constantly by building more and more GP offices and employing more and more doctors, which means more and more people come in. You, you'll never gain control like that. Masses and masses of GP offices is not the answer, people. It really isn't. Um, oh, psychiatry emergency. Probably do this. He's okay, but he's not amazing. And he's actually on a break. Hmm. Yes. Send you home. Um. Yes. Yes. Seven of them. Let's do it. Um, let's get more on training. Um. Brandy here. Actually, before we do that, have we got any janitors? Oh. Oh, you're you're horrible. 
You're okay. Let's get them in. I think we're going to train you in motivation. Excellent. Um, let's just go to job assignments for the one we just employed. There we go. Oh my god, look at that. Here they come. Here they come. Right. We need to get them to the top of the queue. Like that. They don't actually need to be in this queue. Um, then let's get them to the top of this queue. Uh, as well. And where's our other psychiatrist? It's time for him to come back now. Can we get... No, he's on his way. Can't pick him up. He's doing it though. There we go. Excellent. Lovely. Lovely jubblies. Oh, we could do another assistant. But I think it's time to get the GPs going. This GP is actually on break. So let's get them trained in GP2 with uh, Dr. Huggles here. So we're, you know, we're doing it, but we've got an emergency on here, which is why these are, are overcrowded. And our GPs and diagnosis uh, staff could be better, which will help with the, uh, the odd Q uh, that we're seeing pop up over the GP offices. Yeah, so training at the moment really is um, our thing. And maybe a staff room. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button. As long as you are here, why not check out one of my delectable videos available? Feel free to come stalk me on social media and be sure to share this video with friends so even more may watch my shizwa. See you next time, peeps.